Daryl here. I'll bet you're trying to figure out why your video's frozen at 301 views and not going anywhere. Well, in this video, not only am I gonna show you why it freezes at 301, but how YouTube actually works globally. Stay tuned. Now, before I can explain to you why the video freezes at 301, we need to understand YouTube and how it operates globally. Now, this is really simple. YouTube actually has a facility that stores your videos and they're all over the world. For example, if I'm ready to upload a video and I'm in the United States, it's gonna find a data center closest to me. That data facility will actually house that video. So we upload it and once it's housed there, it's gonna make a copy of it or what they call cache, and it's gonna send it out to all their other data facilities throughout the world. Now your video is actually stored around the world. So if you're in Madagascar, you're gonna find the facility closest to you to watch that video. It's not gonna go all the way back to the United States to watch that video, or the same in Australia, or in Beijing, or in New York, or wherever you're at. So let me just show you this as, as an example. So if we have actually Jose, and Jose lives in Paraguay, Jose wants to watch your video. He searches for it and he actually finds it, clicks on it, and once he goes, he goes right to the data center that's closest to him. Now, that actually records as a video of you. Now, this is where you wanna pay attention. Uh, when he watches that video, it actually creates a log and that log pops up and says, oh, Jose just watched this from Paraguay and that's one video view. Then that log is actually sent back uh, to a central location saying that it recorded one view at that YouTube facility. Now, once that's done, YouTube then updates it across the board, like all the servers across the board saying that that one video actually has a view. Now, here's where it gets really interesting. Let's say that we have 998 people want to watch that video um, in one day. So they're all around the world all hitting different facilities. They're all getting those different video views. The log files are starting to come up and it sends it back to that central location. And what happens next is YouTube does a verification. Okay, it says, wait a minute, we wanna make sure that those 998 views were actually real and not some bot or something like that. So it actually puts it on a temporary hold for 301. That 301 is then sent out to all the different servers out there. So you're able to see the views as 301, why it evaluates to see if those are actual views. Once it goes through that uh, verification process, uh, you'll go ahead and get a green light, then the hold comes off, and then you actually have all your video views. Hey, thanks for watching that video. Now, as I'm waiting for this to stop at 301 exactly, make sure you subscribe to my channel and give me a thumbs up.